How to delete a VMware virtual machine snapshot with Ansible? I'm going to show you a live demo and some simple Ansible code. I'm Luca Burton and welcome to today's episode of Ansible Pilot. Let's talk about the Ansible module VMware underscore guest underscore snapshot. The full name is community dot vmware dot vmware underscore guest underscore snapshot which means that is part of a collection or module to interact with vmware community supported it manages v machine snapshot in v center parameters the following parameters are useful in order to delete a VMware virtual machine snapshot using the module VMware underscore guest underscore snapshot. First of all, we need to establish the connection with VMware vSphere or VMware vCenter using a plethora of self-explicative parameters, hostname, username, password, data center, and validate underscore certs. Once the connection is successfully established, you could specify the desired snapshot state, in this case, absent, to delete a snapshot. You could also manage a snapshot with the same Ansible module. If you want to remove a snapshot, you could also remove all the dependent snapshots using the parameter remove underscore children. You need to specify the exact snapshot name that you would like to remove in the snapshot underscore name parameter. And now, demo time. How to delete a VMware virtual machine snapshot with Ansible. I'm going to show you how to delete a snapshot of a virtual machine named MyVM using the Ansible playbook named Ansible Manage Snapshot in your VMware vCenter. Are you ready? Let's go! Welcome to my editor. I'm going to show you one Ansible playbook to delete a snapshot. First of all, let's start with the name of our play VM snapshot demo that is going to target hosts only local host, the current Ansible controller. I don't need uh, any root privileges, so let me disable become. Uh, and uh, also, I don't need the system information, so let me disable gather of facts. Uh, only one collection we are using in this playbook uh, that is uh, community.vmware. So we can shorter the module name. Uh, Pre-task, we need. Uh, I would like to include the variable file that I'm using for all the VMware Ansible playbook. In my case, is vars.yml. So all the variable are included in this file. Let me start the task list. Only one remove snapshot using VMware underscore guest underscore snapshot module. Uh, yes, a column here. Oh, here we go. Now, the boring part, uh, let me define all the credentials. First of all, the hostname, in my case, is saved under the variable vcenter underscore hostname. Then, username, same story, vcenter underscore username. And what else? Uh, the password. We always need a password. So, in this case, it's stored under vcenter underscore password. Here we go. Storing in a variable is very convenient. So if you, oh, here I did a typo, username, not hostname. Uh, storing on a variable is very convenient. If you need to change one value, you change only in one place. So I really recommend. And of course, store password in Ansible encrypted vault. Uh, what else? Data center and validate certificate. These are the SSL certificate for encryption that uh, came out uh, as a self-signed so if you want to try you need to disable 
Okay, now name is the virtual machine name that I'm storing under vm underscore name. The folder of the virtual machine is stored under vm folder, so everything is a variable in this uh, playbook. And the snapshot name in this case is the name, exact name of a snapshot. In my case is Ansible Managed Snapshot. Feel free to customize with the one that you needed. And the state must be absent because we would like to delete this one. Wouldn't we? Okay, so that's it. This simple Ansible playbook is going to remove the Ansible Managed Snapshot from VM name my VM in our VMware infrastructure. Do you believe? Just a few lines of code and we are able to automate. You probably are curious what is stored under my variable file. Well, only some variable and value, so every key is like a key value as you can see. This center is my vmwareexample.com, the name of a virtual machine and a simple username and password. Feel free to customize with your infrastructure variable. This is the status of my VM virtual machine inside my vCenter and as you can see there is an Ansible managed snapshot already created. Now let's have a fun. First of all, welcome to my terminal. Let me connect to my Ansible controller via SSH DevOps is the username at demoexample.com. I already copied all the file under the VMware directory and there are all the files of these lessons. So let me execute my Ansible playbook with ansible-playbook command vm underscore snapshot underscore remove dot yml. The execution will be very fast, just the time to include the variable and connect to the VMware infrastructure to delete the snapshot. And we got a change status, which means some operation were performed on the target machine. Now, what happens if we execute again the same code? Well, we are expecting OK status, because the snapshot was already deleted and not present anymore. And yay, success! Let's take a look on our VMware infrastructure result. As expected, in my VMware vCenter, I'm not able to see any snapshot for the my VM. Great, so the Ansible managed uh, snapshot was successfully deleted. Yay, great success! Now you know how to delete a VMware virtual machine snapshot with Ansible. And great, we automate one more thing of our system administrator day. Thank you for watching, see us on the next lesson of Ansible Pilot and have a great day, yay! This video is part of our Ansible automation program. Sign up today on www.ansiblepilot.com for uninterrupted exclusive video and so much fun!